Hey guys, what's up Capricorn? Thanks for watching, appreciate it. This is going to be a reading for your immediate future, the situation, any obstacles in your way, and the outcome of that situation. So keep in mind that the energies can go both ways. This could be your energy or the energy of the person you're dealing with, somebody around you. So flip it how you need to. Also remember, it's a general reading. So just take what's yours, leave the rest behind. If it does resonate, please make sure that you like and subscribe below. Also, if you'd like to contact me for a personal reading, that's below as well. All right, media, there you are. You're manifesting, wow, you're manifesting love and it's mutual. Could be a water sign, doesn't even matter, air sign. Somebody who may not have been like as open to it before may kind of be having a change of mind now. All right, immediate future, what's coming up for Capricorn, please? You have the higher fence, Taurus energy, the nine of pentacles, which is great for your money. And um, it, it can be a card of being single. But this is almost like a lot of like finding oneself. Um, somebody's doing some contemplating. Money looks good. Finances look good. All right. Show me this higher fin, please, for Capricorn, please. So numbers are breaking down to a five. Fives are about change. Sometimes with change, there can be some conflict. You got the eight of cups. You walked away from something over here. This could be a marriage. It could have been a long-term commitment. You kind of, um, wow, what in the world? Okay, two messages that are here. Somebody walked away from a situation over here and got their heart broke. This is a lot of devastation. Somebody could have been, you know, somebody could have just ghosted and not really saying anything. But also, this could be a marriage or something that was like a little bit deeper. Um, and not that that, but this could have led to like financial difficulties. For some, it could be work, career, like around that there, there was financial setbacks. Um, even like maybe even a total wipeout. That's pain. It doesn't matter if it's a relationship or financially. That's that's hurt. Show me this nine of pentacles, please. So for some, there could have been like a setback on a bill recently. Um, but wow, I'm sorry if that was you. Show me this nine of pentacles, please. You have the Nine of Wands. So something here is kind of coming to fruition. So the Nine of Wands with uh, is a Wounded Warrior. It's down but not out. Just tell me about this Nine of Wands. If it's a person, like you could have blocked communication. The sun. That's so good to um, see. Because it looks like you're overcoming challenges. You are finding a lot of happiness. So with the Ace of Cups there and the Nine of Pentacles, it's like self-love. Um, self-love, self-worth and knowing of that because that's that's where it's kind of, that's exactly what this energy is. Finding happiness within self. Which is an awesome come up from what this was. This is like feeling like you put time, energy, love, money, yourself into something and then to just lose it that or to feel like it was lost that's freaking that's a heavy one all right show me the seven of pentacles please for the outcome for capricorn you got the wheel so the wheel is good luck it's it's fate it's divine timing it can be for oh fortune You've been on someone's mind. You have a phone call that's coming. Could be from an air sign, but it doesn't have to be. What happened here was um, you've done a lot of self-care. That's very evident. Uh, definitely somebody could be a little bit more protective of heart. But it's like you took on 
this energy of focusing on self-love, self-care, or you are, and finding a lot of happiness without with that. You could have completely been cold shouldering something, just kind of like blocking it out, moving forward, taking care of you. There is this element, um, I can't remember if we've had this in recent readings, which would make sense. Um, uh, there could be a job opportunity, but kind of, even if it's going out and kind of changing, you know, hairstyle or setting a new routine, that's really been the focus. So now somebody's been on your mind and there's about to be a pretty deep conversation. Make sure you check out the October reading for Capricorn. I can't remember, but I think there was some type of conversation that comes about on a, on a love front for you guys this month. So that's what that kind of reminded me of. But it looks like this is somebody that you know coming back to make amends. <clears throat> All right, Capricorn, I hope this helped. If it resonated, please make sure that you like and subscribe below. If you guys like to contact me for our personal reading, that's below as well. You guys take care, and I will see you next time. Bye.